um, stories here. Um, all this hard work and all these uh, meetings and so on, we have uh, been spending time on how are we getting that knowledge across. And we, uh, we started already in, in Glasgow uh, talking about how are we going to uh, finish this and uh, how is the format of the report going to be. Because sometimes we talked about that uh, sometimes projects end up in a report with the several hundred pages that no one reads. So we thought it was a very important point for us that uh, the finished product, this, uh, should be in a format that uh, was readable for everyone and understandable for everyone, not just at a political level. That was uh, very important for us and um, we think that we have uh, succeeded in that task. So um, I hope you will think the same when you read the report if you haven't already read it. The report is uh, available on the website shortly after the conference. And uh, if you need a copy like this, you can contact your national agency to uh, get it. So um, in, my, in my world, this uh, product is a little miracle. Uh, this uh, project, um, as you have now seen uh, the process in that, um, it has been a fantastic uh, journey and um, experience working with all these uh, fantastic people from uh, these uh, countries. So, um, um, especially, uh, I have to say, while I have the floor here, uh, I have to uh, say a special thanks to, where is he, Ricard? What? He's there. A very, very special man who uh, really wants this, so we hope that this product will be uh, the start of um, a better life for deafblind people across Europe. So I hope you will enjoy the report when you uh, read it in the future. And now I won't take uh, any more of your time. So I'll just say uh, thank you, everybody, for coming. Thanks.